Good morning, everyone. My camera's already on low battery, but I wanted today to mark the first day of me officially starting vlogging again. So here I am. I'm actually gonna go to weight training. Um, normally on Saturdays, I have like a power class, which is like weight training, and I also have like a high intensity interval training kind of thing. Um, let's get the terms out of the way since I'm going to be using these a lot. High intensity interval training is also known as a HIT workout. So normally on Saturday mornings I have a HIT workout. And basically what that is is it's like like squat jacks and like just doing very high intensity like high volume exercises that really get your heart rate up. It's kind of like Tabata sort of if you know what that is. But anyway, so Saturday mornings I have HIIT workouts and then I have strength training afterwards. But I'm not going to be going to my HIIT workout because I really, really hurt. I didn't really, really hurt it because I'm walking on it. But last week, my muscle in my leg, like in my calf, flared up. And it was like really bad. And it was super painful. So I'm kind of like trying to rest it. And I've actually been foam rolling it, which this thing is like the coolest thing ever. So this really has helped my muscles. I really have to do laundry, by the way. Yeah, really cute. I just thought I would show you. I'm drinking the apricot tea. And I've also been really loving the tiny tea, which I talked about in my February favorites video. It's so good. Like, it seriously has helped me so much. Okay, and then this, I love how this is all like matchy. Do you see like the pink trend going on here? And like the little intricate designs? This definitely was not planned. Okay. So this is the Farmhouse Fresh Pink Moon Shea Butter Moisturizer. And please look at my nails, they're so gross. But don't worry, I went to Sally's and I got nail polish remover because I ran out. So I will fix the nail issue. But this smells like, I can honestly say that it's one of the best smelling smells I've ever smelled. Anyway, so this is a super great moisturizer and then these are sweet potato chips and I eat these after I weight train because these are a really good source of carbohydrates. I was telling you guys that I got nail polish remover and I ran out of my nail polish drying spray which if you watched any of my other vlogs I probably talked about it. And I also got, I needed a new out the door top coat. This is the best top coat I've ever used. And then the lady told me to just get the pure acetone. I don't know how bad this is for your nails but I don't paint my nails every single day so I just took her advice and I got the pure acetone. I also needed a new nail file so I got a pink sparkly one of course. I think I'm gonna show you guys what's in my gym bag. Well, kind of what's in my gym bag. What I'm going to put in my gym bags. So my camera battery actually died. So I don't know what I was talking about before this, but I'm gonna show you, I think I was talking about what's in my gym bag. So I'll real quickly go through that. So I have the Tiger Bomb, as I said. So in my bag, this one's from Lorna Jane as well. Um, I have headphones in here. And then I have the little makeup wipes. These are awesome after the gym if you just wanna like wipe off really quick. These are great. So those are from Trader Joe's, little makeup wipes. And then it comes with this little thing that you can put your phone in, but I never put my phone in that because it's like, it's kind of hard to like get it out if I, you know, I could just like stick it in the little pocket here. Which, speaking of the pocket, I have a headband, which is kind of dirty now that I see that. Little stevia packets. Also have my weight training gloves, which are from Lorna Jane as well. And then normally I'll put like my food that I'm taking for afterwards or like a protein bar or something like that. Obviously my phone. A lot of you guys were asking me about this little Lorna Jane like fitness journal thing and it was like, I don't know if they still sell it because it was kind of like a start of the new year thing, but it's their move, nourish, believe thing. And basically, I keep a food journal. A lot of you guys know that I used to have an eating disorder. I think you should just eat healthy food. And for me, it just helps me to write it down because I literally could eat like tons and tons of food. And I was actually reading this article the other day. Carrie Underwood keeps a food journal and she just jots everything that she eats down. She just writes it down and it kind of helps keep perspective on really how much food you're eating. And it's not like necessarily about like, oh, I shouldn't have that cupcake because I don't want to write that in my food journal. It's nothing like that. It's just keeping tabs on what you're feeling and putting in your body. So I write down everything that I eat and I just ate breakfast, so I'm gonna write that down. But um, it's really nice and convenient because there's a lot of lines on here. And so, I don't know, I just, I really like it. And it's super motivating, it's really cute. So anyway, so that's that. And now I'm going to go wash my face now. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys my current skincare routine for the morning because my skin has been 
so much better ever since using these products. So first of all, we have the Josie Moran Argon Cleansing Oil, which is awesome because I don't need to use a moisturizer afterwards. And then this is the uh, Oil Hendrickson, I don't know, but it's their Vitamin C Truth Serum, which is amazing. It makes your skin so radiant and smooth. And then in the morning, I use a little bit of their SPF. This is SPF 50, and I just put this on as just like a daily kind of sunscreen moisturizer. Then my headband, which I do not know where this is from, but I wear this to wash my face because it keeps your hair from getting wet. All right, people, let's go strength train. So I finished strength training and I'm feeling okay. My leg's feeling good. Oh shoot, I forgot to stretch in there and I'm already in my car and I'm too lazy to walk back inside because I just said bye to everyone to be weird if I was like oh hey just kidding I'm back is anybody else like that okay anyway I'm just gonna go home and stretch it but um anyway I'm gonna eat my sweet potato chips it's I don't know if I'm gonna ever try and vlog in there just because it's local so it's like yeah you know I just want to be safe so anyway um, maybe one day I will try and figure out how to like vlog in there but I'm gonna drive home and it's a beautiful day I'm so excited it's just such a gorgeous day and this thing is going off but anyway all right I'll see you guys at home Grace here where are we going to the cafe we're going to eat a late breakfast slash early lunch it's 11 30 and me and Grace like to go to this cafe sorry this is loud but I really like my music on and slightly loud when I'm driving. Don't worry, I am a safe driver. I finished strength training. We're gonna go get a healthy breakfast lunch. And let's go see you there. It's so pretty today. So, Grace, we decided to get Thai food, huh? I'm you so got an happy. iPhone, what's your case? Oh, okay, my mom picked it out. It says, check me out with a cat. It's like we're a really, pun. we're really into we're puns. Really into puns. We're it's really so into bad. puns right now. It's we really have like hilarious. all the pun apps yeah. and like I like follow. Yeah, they have iPhone pun Instagram apps. Instagram and I just like send her pictures. In it's the late so hours funny. Of the night. So we got chicken satay and they have like a peanut sauce. Are you excited, Grace? Yeah, I'm taking pictures. Oh, okay. Of course, we're gonna eat now. I got. Oh my gosh, I got a caveman meal. Yeah, got my barbecue, barbecue chicken. chicken. Chicken satay. And I got this pie shrimp salad. So we just whoa hair. So we just got done picking up some groceries and I wanted to share this with you guys. This is this Kavita sparkling probiotic drink. Of course we gotta have the coconut. It's strawberry acai. It's amazing. So we got some vegetables, we got grace, we got a pie, didn't we? A triple berry pie. Triple berry pie. For the birth. The day of yep, because it was Grace's birthday on March 3rd. And then it's my birthday on March 13th, and I'm gonna be 18 years old. So I'm gonna drink this, and we are gonna go. I'm, I'm gonna drink, not alcohol, and drive. And then wow. what are we doing? Well, I was gonna say I'm gonna drink and drive, but then I realized that that's really bad. <laughs> we're going, but it's not. It's just we're it's going just probiotic. To some movies and get apples to apples, because apples to apples is the best game ever. And then ice cream. And then ice cream. Yep. There we go. We are off. Yeah, maybe I could when I'm on your show. Grace and I are trying to pick out ice cream flavors for her birthday, and you guys, they literally have cinnamon bun ice cream right there. Look at that. I don't know what to do with myself. Get cinnamon bun. What are you getting here? Red vines. And everything. What are you gonna get? They have pumpkin. Why do they have pumpkin? I don't know, but it's so good. Vanilla and chocolate. I didn't get chocolate chip. Should I get chocolate chip? They have chip for chocolate chip. Oh my. Coffee and cookies are Should I get hip 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 chocolate chip? Hip hip hip. No, chocolate chip's so boring. I'm getting some more. Oh my. Did you even see these flavors? They have some more sprays. You did? Yes. Wait, what's the difference? Oh, half the fat? I don't want half the fat. I don't want the whole fat. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Look, they have coconut. Those are delicious. Those it's it's the mint flavor. 
Kit Kats. Look, they have dairy free. This is my favorite stuff, guys, right? We're going to tra ah, we're going to Trader Joe's. First day black vlogging and we're going to Trader Joe's. Let's go. Grace, you left me. What did we get? Woohoo! Birthday! Birthday adventure! <laughs> birthday adventure. Hey guys, so my little sister had her birthday that night, which was crazy. I'm drinking tea, by the way, I'm drinking the your tea. If you remember where this mug is from, then. Okay, anyway, so I got back from a three mile beach run, which was awesome. I wanna take a sip of tea, hold on. Grace had her birthday and um, I didn't think I'd be like too exciting to vlog like they were all just hanging out and, like eating food and being crazy and stuff so it's actually now later on in the week I've just been busy honestly I am really excited my birthday's tomorrow it's the 12th and it's my last day being a minor <laughs> all of my other birthdays have been have always been kind of bittersweet because because it's like you're ending like a chapter sort of of your life that like that age is like over you know and I feel like every age people don't go through the same exact things but you know every age has its like trials and mountains if you will and so um, stepping into like adulthood really is kind of like scary but it's really exciting because it's like a lot more responsibility and freedom and I'm pretty excited but I'm kind of like oh like it kind of sucks but it's kind of awesome so I don't really know, but it's my last day, so I wanted to like vlog and like talk for just a moment. I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. My friends go to school and they go to work. So the day, and I don't, like I'm, I'm almost done with school as far as my school. I have a few more assignments to do. But like as far as like school, like I don't go to school like because I do online schooling. So I just have a couple more assignments to finish up and then I'm done with school. But the assignments are like ridiculously hard like they are so incredibly difficult I literally like I'm a good student like I graduated well I'm finishing one more class with just a few assignments and I will get the grade that I want but um it's very stressful for me right now like ugh, I will get the grade that I intend on getting because I will and I'm gonna work for it but like it's literally so hard like I don't even understand the prompt like I have to read the prompt like four times and I still don't really get it. It's like one of those things where you have to like read every single word and like, ugh, like it's like, it's so difficult. <laughs> anyway, once I finish up those assignments, I'll be done with school and then I'm so excited to like do Q and A's on this channel and do like advice videos. I wanna start doing like question videos, like like kind of like Nikki Philippi does because I love those Nikki videos and I was actually in one that she did. And I love that people um, kind of send like specific questions and then she answers them and so it kind of gives like an answer to the question and then like a general like sort of like um, her thesis statement like <laughs> basically something that everybody can take away from the question. Um, basically, not the question, but the answer to the question, so I hope that kind of makes sense. I want to start doing those, and I want to do more Q&As from you guys, like on Twitter and stuff like that, and I want to do, obviously, daily vlogs. I'm going to vlog my birthday tomorrow, even though I don't know how exciting it will be, because um, my friend Bree is coming to visit me. I'm so excited. She's coming this weekend, though, so she'll be here Friday night, staying through the weekend, and then I'm actually going to go to Orange County to visit my friends, Southern California, um, at the end of this month, kind of early April so I'll be vlogging that. I definitely will be vlogging, but just like tomorrow on my actual birthday, I don't know what I'm doing. And so I guess it's kind of fun because it's like a surprise, but not really a surprise. Eh, whatever. Yeah, I went for my last run workout ever today as a child and it was awesome. I love the beach and I was running on the beach and I just felt like so just like at peace like I was I'm kind of nervous not for like my birthday that I feel like everything's gonna just like change tomorrow because I'll be 18 but just like stepping into like what I want to do and like there's so many things that I just am unsure of and I don't really know where I'm going if that makes sense I mean I guess nobody really knows where they're going at almost 18 years old and if you do then kudos to you <laughs> but I don't have my life figured out yet <laughs> and I don't know if I ever will but um, it's kind of a scary thing and it's kind of an awesome thing because you don't really know what's gonna happen and I guess that's like the cool part about life is that 
is that things change all the time and sometimes it sucks, but sometimes it's awesome and we need change and like sometimes change is uncomfortable, but I think that it, I think it's good in the long run. Like it, it makes, it makes you think about things and it kind of keeps life interesting. So, um, yeah, that's kind of my opinion on like change and growing up and all that kind of stuff. So anyway, I'm going to finish this tea now because I'm almost done. Also, if you have an intro for these vlogs, like a five second intro, I don't want anything that's like 10 seconds long because I just think that that's annoying. But if somebody wants to make me like a cool little jingle or like a little five second intro, send it to me, brielovesbeauty at gmail.com for this vlog channel. And that would be awesome because I think that'd be so exciting. So it could be anything like Brie Loves Vlogs or like Cambria Joy Vlogs or Cambria Vlogs or whatever. <laughs> totally do not have to, but if you want to, be super rad and I will see you guys later. Bye!